Piers Linney. I'm currently the co-CEO of a cloud computing service provider called Outsourcery PLC. So I've always been wanted to be in business. I didn't, know what, I didn't know what an entrepreneur was. And I started in business at the age of 13. So I had a paper round, which was very grim up north at the time, the weather. So I cut out my local newsagent, went straight to the wholesaler, and I delivered Sunday papers because nobody did. And I trebled my income, which used to be over a week, just for doing it in one morning. And really it was about me, in, in a minor way, wealth creation. It was about buying that new bike. That's what inspired me, really. And I think, to me, success really is about being able to do what I want to do, when I want to do it, look after my family, have some fun with my friends. That's it, to be quite frank. But increasingly, as I get older, it's now about you know the philanthropy as well. What do I do with the excess? Something I'm quite focused on in terms of entrepreneurs is funding, access to finance. And the market's changed, it's evolving, you know, you've got funding circle, things like that out there, new sources of equity. But there's a huge problem in the middle. And people hope that the kind of you know, the West Coast, um, New England funds come over and sort it out. It hasn't quite happened yet. So you can be a fantastic startup. When you come to your series C, D, E, you need to raise several million, it's very difficult. And I've been there myself. You know, we had to fund my own company to the tune of 10 million personally, and my business partner another 10 because nobody would fund us. And you know, that, that's a structural issue we need to deal with. So, you know, you learn from failure. Uh, I've had quite a few failures uh, over time. You know, some not immediately businesses, just sometimes, you know, career choices and various other things. And I think to me, you do learn from it. It's a bit of a cliche. And I think in, in the US, it's understood a bit more than perhaps in the UK. But I've learned a huge amount from things that haven't gone right. But I think over time, what I've learned is, is that when you know things aren't going right, it's to actually do something about it earlier, if it's, even if it's quite draconian because life gets shorter as you get older. When you're young, you will keep perhaps chasing rabbits down holes where perhaps you should just fill the hole in. If you're a young person looking for a mentor, um, choose carefully. You know, it doesn't mean because someone's experienced that they're gonna be a good mentor. Do they have the time? Do they have a, a, a sort of, a, even it's a simple one, but a, a process to work with you? And otherwise, you, you start these relationships out and they're doomed to failure, and you both feel as though, you know, something's gone wrong. So just structure it and think about it. Mm -hmm.